imagine your husband naming the woman he wants the elf. Child, let's get into it. Introducing the real Will Smith. The 53-year-old actor appears on GQ's November issue, where he opens up about his forthcoming memoir, Will, and provides new insights into his over 20-year marriage to Jada Pinkett Smith, addressing Jada's self-proclaimed entanglement with R&B singer August Alsina, which she discussed publicly with Will on Red Table Talk in July 2020. At the end of the day, yeah. I don't like how all of this came to be, mm -hmm. but that doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. It's all love. Mm -hmm. The Hitch star shares further details into the dynamics of their unconventional relationship, saying, quote, Jada never believed in conventional marriage. Jada had family members that had an unconventional relationship. So she grew up in a way that was very different than how I grew up. There were significant endless discussions about what is relational perfection, what is the perfect way to interact as a couple, and for the large part of our relationship, monogamy was what we chose, not thinking of monogamy as the only relational perfection. The father of three explains to GQ that his marriage to Jada has been built on authenticity, adding, we have given each other trust and freedom with the belief that everybody has to find their own way, and marriage for us can't be a prison, and I don't suggest suggest our road for anybody. I don't suggest this road for anybody. He continues, but the experience is that the freedoms that we've given one another and the unconditional support to me is the highest definition of love. The story goes on to claim, Will explain that Jada was not the only one engaging in other sexual relationships outside of their marriage. Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. I'm Lady T. Please be sure to hit that like button down below. Don't forget, if this is your first time watching of the channel, to crush that subscribe button and notification bell. That will really mean a lot. So let's get into the story. Doing an interview with GQ, Will Smith opened up about his personal life, his love life, and career. The actor speaks about his unconventional marriage with his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. Will confess if given the chance to have anything he wanted, he'll want a group of girlfriends that included Holly Berry and Missy Copeland. Now, here's my thought and opinion on this interview. I feel like Will admitted in the interview what we already knew for years from the rumors that Jada and him have a open marriage. How long have it been open? You know, that's not clear. I'm guessing it's probably maybe 10 years. But he said all that big long passage just to say we have relations with other people. I wish Will and Jada would just shut up. Every time these two open up their mouth, it's always some BS we the people really don't want to know. Now, why would you bring someone else's name into this whole openness? Isn't it made Jada jealous? I know Halle Berry probably like... These celebrities overshare their personal information for what reason? I don't know. I realize that this was a hypothetical, I hope, conversation in therapy. What I do find tacky is talking about women... You know colleagues in the in the industry this way like your fantasies about wanting to be in a harem is weird and kind of degrading you know missy copeland and holly berry are very accomplished women he could have told his story without naming names holly berry have always struggled to be taken serious and people have downright been nasty when she tried to speak out she took so much heat when she was trying to complain about Adrian Brody kissing her without her consent at the Oscars. Like these men really just see her as an object to be lust after. Will and Jada are fine to do whatever they want to do, but the way they speak also impact other people, especially their family. Jada and Will seem very happy being miserable with each other. 
they never sat right with me after that whole red table talk last year and the August Alcina uh, situation, you know, sleeping with her son's friend. Imagine your wife paying homage to an ex friend years after his death, but never treats the husband the same. And I'm talking about Tupac, y'all. I mean, make it make sense. I would be so embarrassed if that was their children. It seemed like they're trying to embarrass each other because none of this information needed to be shared with the public. And I understand that Will's coming out with a memoir, but again, a lot of stuff just don't need to be shared. Just get a divorce and go by your business. It's clearly a wrap for these two. Jada's out here shaving her damn head when what she really needs to get rid of is the sham of a marriage. They both need to do some soul searching because at this age, sharing what they feel about their 20 plus year marriage public is beyond me. Let's get a divorce and you can be happy doing your thing and you can be happy doing yours. And that's that. And just be friends. All right, guys, that's it. Please don't forget to drop down in the comments and tell me your thoughts on this story. Make sure to like this video and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss a video. I will catch you the next time. I'm Lady T. Be blessed. Bye. <laughs>